uh, is not a bargaining agent. <laughs> There's no collective bargaining agreement between the UFCW and Walmart since the workers have not decided to certify a union. Uh, Fred Zolik is our guest. He's with, the work, he's with the Workforce Fairness Institute. I was reading a story today uh, in the Wall Street Journal about this as well. Agency admonishes Walmart over protests, NLRB pushing retailer to settle disputes with worker groups. It's an interesting choice of words, worker groups, not unions. Fred, thanks for joining us this morning. Good morning. All right, well, you heard my preamble. Would you like to expand on that? Yeah, it, this could all be one huge coincidence. But things that happen around unions and the NLRB generally aren't coincidences. Uh, this group that you refer to, our Walmart, was holding a conference call yesterday with the uh, United Food and Commercial Workers Union and Richard Trumpka from the AFL-CIO to announce their plans for, for protesting on Black Friday. And all of a sudden they announced for the NLRB that the NLRB will be filing a complaint against Walmart but the NLRB hadn't done it yet. It was not public knowledge. Somehow these unions and left-wing organizations knew about it before the NLRB made it public. So, you know, we've always known that there's a hand-in-glove relationship between big labor and the NLRB, but this is a little out of control.